Welcome to Magic Info Services. In this video, I would like to show you how to change the display orientation and how to create the right content for the right display orientation. So as you can see, the device is currently in landscape mode. And what I will do at first is I will change the source. Because if I change the source, for example, to HDMI 1, the menu allows me to have more options to change. So I will do that as you can see. And what I will do right now is click on menu, go to the on-screen display, select the display orientation, select the very first option, and I will change this one to portrait. Now it asks me if I agree on changing all settings to portrait mode, which I will select on yes, because that means it's also changing the menu to portrait mode. So right now my device is fully in portrait mode. And if I go back to the Magic Info source where my content is running, you will see that the display has been turned. Now, it, this is not the most ideal situation in terms of content. So you have to make sure that your content is also created in portrait mode in case you change your device to portrait mode. So I will now head over to Magic Info to see how that works. So as soon as we sign in, I head over to the web author, select your supported device, and by default, the content is in landscape mode. So I can now head over to content and drag and drop my content items in here, like you're used to in the web author. However, since my device is now in portrait mode, I would like to work with a portrait template. So I can here select my portrait template and as you can see, the template changes to portrait. Now I can drag and drop my item in here. I can add pages and by clicking on this change symbol, you can see that I'm adding pages in the web author. However, it's not possible to have one page in landscape and one page in portrait, not within the same LFD file. So what you then have to do is once you create your content in portrait mode or in landscape, whatever your device is set up to, is of course you have to save your LFD file, make sure the right content is created in the right way, schedule it, and that's how to work with the different display orientations. Thanks for watching.